It's turned out of the subject on most folks' mind this afternoon. The rain and the flooding. Northumberland County residents are picking up the pieces after floodwaters left many with ruined basements. Eyewitness News reporter Crystal Cranmore spoke to some of those residents. She joins us live in the Wilkesbury newsroom with more tonight. Crystal? Well, Nick, I spent most of today in the Herndon area of Northumberland County. It's a mess, especially for those who may live at the bottom of a hill or in a deep valley. The water kept flowing and flowing. It washed out. There's about a two foot deep hole right there beside the road. And flowing. Residents at the bottom of Pottsville Street in Herndon seemed to get the worst of the flooding on this stretch of road Tuesday afternoon. It's definitely the first time we had it in our house. Randy Crawlman didn't get any flooding in his home, but his backyard was beaten up pretty badly. You couldn't even see the road here, and it was gushing down the driveway and beside my house here. Look at a waterfall. Crawlman is working on getting a crew out to clean up the mud and stones, but that's not all Mother Nature did. The power of the water was so strong that it washed away a portion of this driveway, preventing this truck from getting out. Residents say living at the bottom of Pottsville Street, runoff like this happens. It does, but not like it did this time. Now, coming up on Eyewitness News at 6 p.m., I'm going to introduce you to a man whose house was spared during Hurricane Agnes, but this time he wasn't so lucky. In the newsroom, Crystal Cranmore, Eyewitness News. A lot of cleanup left tonight. Crystal, thanks.